welcome to another Pinterest Friday. I haven't done one for a couple weeks because we've been doing baby stuff. Today, um, I am gonna try out a bread machine recipe for cinnamon rolls. I have this wonderful bread machine. If any of you guys have one, you know they're like, they're like magic. They really are like magic. So we're gonna try it out today. It's cold, it's probably gonna snow later, and I just felt like it, so this is what we're gonna do. I'm finding my recipe today on um, food.com. I'll link the recipe below, and uh, we'll see if it works. Jingle bells, 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 jingle then all the dry, and then all the wet on top. So it's like completely opposite of what mine is, so. I don't know. Good milk. Oh, I didn't do water. Where's the water supposed to go? Sugar, salt, and yeast. We're good to go. Oh my goodness, I'm being silly. And then put it on the dough setting and just wait for the magic to happen. Don't gotta do it fast. I guess that's what I do every day. Hmm. I wanna taste it. Okay, uh, it's done. The dough cycle is done. Let's check it out. Oh, that looks good. Normally with my bread maker, if it doesn't work, you can tell right away because it's all like crusty and not like mixed at all. But this looks amazing. Mmm, look how yummy that looks. Okay, I gotta check the recipe and see what else we need to do with this bundle of joy. So you put flour. Am I supposed to be preheating? I never know what to do when I'm supposed to be making a particular shape with the dough, but it's like, Weird, like up here it's curvy and not. I don't know. Does it work if I like squish it down like that? Does that work? <laughs> so I'm always frustrated. I know when I'm like wanting to make something super yummy and I look up the recipe, but the whoever's making it has some crazy tool that I don't have and so I can't use that recipe anymore. So this is kind of what this video is. Obviously if you don't have a bread machine or access to one, then this will be kind of hard for you. But I hope you guys can be inspired to make something and like do some Christmas baking because it's so fun to share. And even if you don't have a bread machine, you can still make cinnamon rolls. Anyway, I'm gonna make the filling now. because they're supposed to raise like they're supposed to double in size so I split them up into two different pans I really don't know what I'm doing guys this could be a really embarrassing video I just hope they turn out good enough for me to eat I don't care how they look that can come later and Porter here is uh, trying to make his own lunch because it is lunch time what was that peanut butter Porter is really trying hard to do a peanut butter sandwich Try flipping it here if you do your knife. And it started snowing outside, yay! You see that little kind of wimpy snow out there? In my opinion, if it is cold enough to be snowing, then it should be snowing outside. So I'm very happy about this. 
I am. In the meantime, we are going to make some lunch. These need to raise for another um, half an hour and then we'll cook them. Kids are gonna take a nap, hope they can get some work done. So it'll be a good, good afternoon, especially if it includes cinnamon rolls in the end, so. Okay, Porter, I think that's enough peanut butter. Okay, I think these are actually rising. It means they're getting bigger. They just sit here and they get bigger and bigger. Okay, we put the rolls in and they are cooking. And making this frosting and our timer is about to go off on our cinnamon roll. Let's check them out. Yay! These look good. I hope they're not overcooked. That could be the worst thing ever. My house smells so good right now. I'm not loving how this frosting is turning out. Like super, I don't know, it doesn't seem very like frosting to me. I think we're gonna have to put some on one of the cinnamon rolls and try it. It's the only way to find out if it's any good. It doesn't taste bad, but is it like so perfect yummy? No. What? Not bad. Not bad at all. For a newbie like myself. Will I use this recipe again? Um, yeah. I think I would use the dough recipe again. Not sure about the icing. And obviously I've learned some things. Like I kind of want bigger cinnamon rolls, so maybe, but I want to have more crumbly, cinnamony, gooey stuff in the middle. So I'm gonna have to, but yeah, they turned out really yummy and I'm excited to share them. I'm excited for my kids to try them. And it was fun, it was fun to make them. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment if you have any comments. And we'll see you on Monday. Have a great weekend, bye.